I have broken the fourth commandment, Padre. You kill somebody? No, that is not the fourth commandment. Of course not. Padre, is everything all right? It sounds that there is a battle going on out there. Don't worry, my dear. You are safe in the house of the Lord. Of course, Padre. Forgive me, Father, for I have sinned. It has been three days since my last confession. Three days? How many sins could you have committed in three days? Come back, would you have more time, please? Excuse me? Listen, senorita. Then, then please, go on. I have broken the fourth commandment, Padre. You killed somebody? No, that is not the fourth commandment. Of course not. You, you, in what way did you break the most sacred of commandments? I dishonored my father. That is not so bad. Maybe your father deserved it. What did you say? I said, tell me more, my child. Well, I try to behave properly the way my father would like me to. But I'm afraid my heart is too wild. Too wild? Yes. Could you be a little more specific about that? I had impure thoughts about a man. Huh? I did. I think he was a bandit or something. He wore a black mask. He had a deep voice? Yes. Ruggedly handsome? I do not know his face was half-covered. But something in his eyes captured me. Captured you? I felt warm, feverish. Lustful? Yes, lustful. Forgive me. Search everything. The chapel, the loft, the rectory, all of it. This is the house of God. Don't worry, Padre. We'll be gone by the time he gets back. Senorita, you have done nothing wrong. The only sin would be to deny what your heart truly feels. Now go. Later. What are you doing here? I was confessing. Confessing? Yes. To whom? The priest is here. Stand back, Elena. Please. Out of respect for Miss Montero, I'll deal with you later.